Hurt. Hold it. I think it was pretty. I think it was pretty white hot on 9/11 when 3,000 people were slaughtered in the streets of the city. So why, you know, what you're doing is you're making a mistake of oversimplifying a very complicated situation. Well, I'm oversimplifying. Yes, you are. We made a mistake on WMDs. That is true. All right, solve the mistake. The, correct the mistake. The mistake for us. How do you correct the mistake? Be corrected. But what can happen is, and I'm praying it is happening, is that we stabilize that situation over there so that it becomes a functioning democracy. It might not happen. But the intent was noble, to make it a democracy, to make Afghanistan a democracy, to put pressure on the Iranians who are causing all kinds of trouble. But why, why, did, why, did, why did we stay in Afghanistan? Why did we stay noble. in Afghanistan? It seemed to me that Afghanistan was more directly the source. I mean, there's been no tie proven between Saddam Hussein and, and uh, al-Qaeda. You know the what, Taliban, anything. Well, you know so what Ansar al-Islam is? Do you know what that is? You don't. All right, and I'm not just saying this in a condescending way. I'm really not. Okay? I'm not going to call you a bonehead or a pinhead. Uh. All right. Ansar al-Islam was the al-Qaeda affiliate in northern Iraq that tried to poison the British water supply with ricin. They operated with Saddam Hussein's OK. Again, complicated, but it isn't so black and white, Dave. It isn't we're a bad country, Bush is an I evil did, liar. I didn't, I didn't say That's we were a bad country. I didn't, I didn't say he was an evil liar. Good. You're putting words in my mouth, just the way you put artificial facts in your head. All right. <laughs> We're really friends. Hey, give me one where you, where artificial fact. Where are you going to be for Thanksgiving? Uh, at your house. <laughs> We're coming over as we always do. <laughs> this is an act. This whole thing is a big act. But uh, honestly, I mean, you, you raise some points, uh, but the truth of it is, uh, a reasonable person can't believe what you're saying. No, that's ridiculous. No, 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 it is. That's absurd. No, no, it is. It it's is a total absurdity. At the highest ratings in cable for the last five years. You, wait, uh, then how I, come I can't find the damn show? Uh, it might be your fault. <laughs> okay, that is ridiculous. Oh, golly. Oh, God. Anyway, you, did you enjoy Culture Warrior, the book? I, I haven't read the you book. You really haven't read it? Come on, you're gonna look. You're in the book. I know. I looked at it. I thought, what is he? What is it? The book about sailing? And then I said, <laughs> I said, no, I don't. I don't need that. You'll like the book today. Sure. It's it's full of artificial facts. You'll love it. <laughs> uh, oh gosh, where has the time gone? <laughs> I, I appreciate you coming over here and indulging me because, you know, once again, I'll just end up by saying I have no idea what I'm talking about. But I don't think you do either. You're entitled to your opinion. And you are here. Same for you. Right. Bill O'Reilly, ladies and gentlemen. We'll be right back.